Shalom. I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Akakadash. Double honesty, Apostle Nels, a great new son and salutation to the sincere Aki and Nodjan for our 4,000 men, the one third men and women and children pushing to get, um, to get home, get back to, you know, back to the true understanding, back to our true heritage, you know, in 100%, you know what I'm saying? That uh, is praying and fasting, trying to keep the whole ideas and the law, section of the commandments and the rest of the ability. All right, this brother Yawasa from GMS coming another lesson. Um, I saw uh, I saw this video inside um, a notifications, YouTube notifications, and I didn't get to, to click it, but Holy Spirit led to um, led to a brother posting in our group here in GMS Guyana, right? And um, <clears throat> this lesson is a, a response video to fear him or he will give give out reasons too reasons too all right all right we'll give out reasons to fear him and um and that's that's what's going on because since this year began you know i've been fear the fear the most i've been increasing the most i've been refreshing or reminding me you know how dreadful it can be because we, we can't really sort out the most side ways in no way who can who can give the most side counsel you know um so I'm these precepts I had sent a while back. So, and um, and the fear was based on, you know, because uh, sometimes you get proud, sometimes you get complacent, sometimes you get. Um, and I'm speaking about myself first. I'm speaking from experience. I noticed that um, my behavior was was lax, you know, because you know. You're doing, you're doing the, um, you're doing the works, doing X, Y, and Z, but yet still, but yet still, you, you know, you think that, you know, you're untouchable, you can't be touched. And of recent events, the most I remind me that, yo, I, I bring out the precept all the time to the spirit that the most I um, destroyed both the just and the unjust. You know, it don't matter. Ain't, ain't no, ain't no more for my more. More just than the most high, right? This is Judges chapter 7. Yeah, before I read this precept, no mortal man more just than the most high, whereby he can save him himself. You know, and you can think that, yeah, you um, you can resist these these temptations and these devils on your own. But what the Apostle Paul said in uh, Corinthians, in this Corinthians 10, 1 Corinthians 10, that um, my strength is made perfect in weakness, his strength is. Uh, my, what's that? my grace is sufficient for thee and his strength is made perfect in weakness all right roughly paraphrasing so let me read these few precepts this is judges chapter 7 it's like if you're in the noise i'm uh, doing like a walk and talk here took an early stop from the bus so let me talk take a walk and clear my head something i like to do now and then every day in fact <laughs> anyway that's another story this is Judges chapter 2 verse Judges chapter 7 verse 2 and The Lord said unto Gideon The people that are with thee Are too many for me To give to the Midianites in, To give To give the Midianites Into their hands Lest Israel vaunt themselves against me Saying mine own hand shall save me Yeah So men would probably think that because We're more in number, or we could recruit certain amounts of people for certain following that they could save themselves, or even to, to the extent whereby men believe that they have enough knowledge and understanding that they could save themselves, but it's not so. If it had not been for your help, Hashem Yoshai, every single one of us would be would be um would be dead, doomed, destroyed, utterly wasted, desolate, whatever all those words, you know. If it was not because I think about the temptations that I that, that, that I succumb to when you just when when uh, when you're in a weakened state, you know this flesh is just pressing down upon upon the mind that muses upon things. You know, it says, uh, "Yeah, my own hand shall save me." This is Mark chapter thirteen, verse twenty. And except the Lord had shortened those days, no flesh shall be saved. But for the elect's sake. 
whom he hath chosen, he hath shortened the days. Imagine Moses had to shorten time. Shorten the wicked time while ruling so that we could be saved. So we want to give all praise to you, Shim Yahushai, daily and regularly. You know? That, that he would call a wretched man like me, you know what I'm saying? You gotta give the most high praise because he could have choose anybody, anybody. Could have, scripture says that he could have turned stones into Israelites. So that shit is fearful, yo. That shit is fearful. Especially when you see certain men at a certain level and you're thinking that yo, these men got it going on. But you don't know what's going on behind the scenes. And the most high just did not choose them. Because what the scripture says in Romans 8, that um not willingly, that that um he, he, um, he made man subject unto vanity, but not willingly, but so that uh, for his glory, for his power, for his honor, as the most I could do whatever he pleased. And he wants that fear so he would show more love. So, you know, I'm getting myself right to y'all. I'm pushing things even more as, as best as I can through the spirit. Because this, that's time to getting worse and worse. So, like, like uh, it was you've been saying earlier. Now it's not time to lighten up, now it's time to tighten up, you know? This is Isaiah 4, 3 and 13. Yea, before the day was, I am he, and there is none that can deliver out of my hand. I will work, and who shall let it? All right? So if the most I choose to destroy anybody, it is the most I will, full stop. If the most I choose to save anybody, it is the most I will, full stop. We just got to be patient and trust in Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. Pray and fast. You know, stay, stay in communication with the Akium. You know, and let's first start with me, yo, because this is this is this is a mere confession. This is a mere con. This is a, a confession, so to speak, because I experience these things. You know, you feel you're going for fire. You're going. You're on fire. You're doing this. You're doing that, and then, and then afterward, you get a rhythm going. And something change and you know if you could handle certain things and then you get weakened state and then what happened? Started doing more carnal carnal shit. But that's how all parts of the walk. You just gotta keep getting up. Keep getting up and moving forward. You know? This is Amos chapter 2, verse 14, 16. Therefore the flight shall perish from the swift, and the strong shall not and the strong shall not strengthen his force. Neither shall the mighty deliver himself, neither shall he that handleth the bow, and he that is swift of foot shall not deliver himself, neither shall he that rideth the horse deliver himself. Alright, so all these things, all these all these abilities, all these access to resources or whatever, ain't gonna save nobody. The Mosai is the one that justified. Full stop. You will have compassion whom you will have compassion. Most I bring out judge judgment, judge, dread, dread, um, dread judgments like you. <laughs> dread judgment. We just gotta pay attention, you know. Pay attention to the times and do what needs to be done. Yes, yeah, lucky about that. Yeah, and it says um. Verse 15, neither shall neither shall he stand at the hand that, that handeth, handleth the bow, and he that is swift of foot shall not deliver himself, neither shall he that rideth the horse, horse shall deliver himself. So all these Lamborghinis, all this money, all this power, ain't gonna save nobody. So that's, that's what's fearful, because the scripture says if the righteous scarcely be saved. Verse 16 says, He that is courageous among the mighty shall flee away naked in that day, saith Yahweh, and that's vulnerable and foolish, you know, because the Mosai, the Mosai, Mosai is a, uh, Mosai humbleth those that, that want to exalt themselves, you know. This is Romans chapter 9, verse 15, For he saith unto Moses, I will have mercy in whom I will have mercy, and I will have compassion in whom I will have compassion. All right, so, we gotta fear the Mosa, yo. We gotta stay focused. So, um, I pray that this lesson was an edifying. I wanna give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Ba Ahara Kakwadash.
Gabalanasi apostles and elders of great Musona salutation to the sincere Akiam. Shalawam Abad Babal.